And the first thing to avoid buying in your 20s are business class and first class flights. Now, before you crucify me, Listen, business class and first class tickets really are one of the best things to spend money on when you have real financial abundance. And let's say you're traveling for business or for an event, you know, something where you need to be sharp, you know, you need to be performing well the day or the day after you land. Well, then for sure, fly long haul business or even first class 100%. But the thing is, especially when you're flying for personal use, that means you can't write it off as a business expense. And then the next question you need to ask yourself is you got to start comparing. Let's say you're flying to Bali and you spend $6,000 on return business class tickets and it's $1,200 for economy tickets. For the extra $4,800 that you're saving, what amazing, beautiful experiences could you have in Bali? I mean, for $4,800, that pretty much, you can live a pretty good life for a month, even two months in Bali. You know, spending money on business and first class tickets is totally worth it until you compare the benefit from that compared to the benefit that you could get when you actually arrive at your destination, you know, all the extra money you could spend there.